Hey Leo, welcome to your WLC Weekly Love Connections reading. This will be for those of you who are wanting to get insights with regards to your love connection. If you're interested to um, watch your monthly readings, I've already done them last week, so you can check out in my channel. I do have for all signs in there. To all my subscribers, thank you for your continued support and I truly appreciate you all. All right. If you're new to my channel, welcome. All right, Leo, let's get this started. This is just a weekly read, so let's see what can we get, what storyline can we get today for Leo? General reading. Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter in love four of cups the hangman seven of wands the hierophant the two of wands nine of wands death knight of pentacles Queen of Swords, <laughs> the Magician. Okay. Let's see. What is death here? Oh, wow. Four of Wands. Mm. Okay. At the bottom of the deck, we have Justice. Karma it's, is at play here for whatever reason. In this connection, in this storyline I'm seeing, it's not just the two of you right now. Nothing is um, totally within your control. Whatever is happening is is um, well participated by the bigger force, right? Yeah. The universe is also at play here. Um, the workings of the universe, I mean. Somehow I feel that you don't get um, the full attention from this person. Mm, as much as you did before mm -hmm. as much as you did before and it feels like um, this situation is at the crossroads right now or this could very well be that um, both of you are at a distance from one another yeah but um, in a general sense for the connection it feels like mm, it's at the crossroads Soon things will be decided, but as of the moment, nothing is concrete. Nothing is decided. You're tr still trying to weigh things. You know, are you are you gonna stick with how things went in the past or where in the past, or are you just gonna drop this and move forward? And I feel that that is applicable for both of you. You and the person that you are dealing with are both thinking about it. Hence, the connection itself. The connection is still there between the two of you. But the direction as to where the connection goes from here, um, that is still yet to be decided. Mm -hmm. It feels like somebody here is wanting to open up more, to give more, but the other party seem to be not very welcoming of those type of support. Yeah. The support that somebody wants to give so for instance you want a romantic relationship so you're you're wanting to open up that door to be more romantic to this person and to expect them to be more romantic towards you um, it feels like that this person still has an eye for you but they are not responding in the same level as what you want at that emotional level it may have something to do with um, the material things in life tangible things in life money finances anything related to stability if that is something that is being offered this person is willing to consider and, and think about it but as of the moment in terms of emotions I do see it on your side but not on them okay and um, which is also, on, on the other hand, I, I feel that you already know that. You can feel that. 
yeah because your main energy here is um in as much as you still want to be with this person in this connection um you're also setting stronger boundaries in each step that you take you are thinking what would be the long-term effect for this yeah are you going to win this in the end you know are you going to get this in the end whatever you plan in the end are you going to get that in every step that you make and i i like it to see, i like to see here that um you are actually building that type of boundaries with this person and um you have stepped back also in as much as you want to offer more emotional um bonding or connection um it feels like you are also taking some time off yeah to really think things through and i feel that at the end of this process of self-discovery or self-analysis or at least you thinking you know thinking and analyzing about the current situation seeing your viewpoint and seeing the other person's viewpoint i feel that you will get to some level of lesson here on, on what really should take place and what next step should you really be taking yeah this is you actually working on your own um or this is you di discerning yeah you are stepping back building good boundaries but discerning as to whether you know what would be the good thing to commit to at the end of this all with this person you have had a lot of drama in, in the situation so drama can go in different ways i couldn't list down everything because each one of you will have your own set of drama in life right but um there's been a lot of um experiences could be good could be get, could be bad in the past that you both have shared yeah but at the same time i feel that you're almost at the tail end of it it feels like you have undergone just a lot of drama that it feels like every drama possible in in the relationship you have already done that you have already experienced it with this person and yet you feel that the connection is still there yeah it feels like it's a soulmate um, kind of connection and even though there's been a lot of drama you still this situation is still um it feels like there is still that one last chance yeah and um it depends to it depends on either of you as to where you want to bring this to yeah are you gonna use this one last chance to build a new foundation or are you gonna just use this one last chance to to close things out mm -hmm. to close things out the person that you're dealing with like i said they are more focused on on the material things in life they are not really actively um pursuing this connection at least they still have eye for this they still think about you they still think about this connection um but their direction is somewhere else right now it's it's looking forward for opportunities you see the um person is holding on to that um what opportunity they may have an opportunity at hand right now and they're thinking where do they want where do they want to um bring it to yeah are they gonna pursue it but there's no action for now at least for this week the way i see it and um also your person could also be busy i feel yeah could also be busy um making do with what they have so for the opportunities around them this is someone who is trying to manifest more and more opportunities at least yeah i feel that um a part of this person is still hoping that things can be worked out between the two of you that things can be made right but as of the moment if you are expecting this person to come forward and make it happen with you i think um they are not in the position to do that for now it's more like this person is waiting for you to at least give them direction at least um give them 
your peace of mind you know what do you really think about this situation are we gonna give this another try um, what are you willing to do what are you willing to accept this is my situation right now so it's it's more like that it's more like this person is is waiting for you to come forward and um, enlighten them as opposed to them uh, rushing towards you yeah but nevertheless I see that um, if you ever do that I feel that this person would also try to tell you what they can and cannot do at this point in their life all right but I do see that this um, connection there could be an ending or the ending has already transpired but most likely there's going to be an ending that would take place and that ending surprisingly could actually bring about some form of liberation could bring about some form of um breakthrough yeah for the situation whatever this drama is that is happening in your in your situation right now it is it seems to be ongoing because both of you are hanging on to it so that tie must break before you can totally achieve the stability in this situation you know there is the saying that you have to let someone go to bring them back in or something yeah something like that the more you hold on to something that is very difficult right now the more the drama will just drag through but once you let it go and let karma play its part you'll see things moving forward faster than it should yeah which could lead you to abundance uh, which could lead you to prosperity i'm gonna leave it at that and i hope this gives you insights and um, let me know if this resonates in the comment section below and don't forget to hit like and subscribe